Arizona. Today I've got a two second fix that bugs me when I QC these frames. If you follow me, I'll show you. By the time I get to these frames, they're already gasketed. So I'm having a problem with using my speed square and checking the rotation from horizontal to vertical. And I'll show you what I mean. So with this gasket in the way here, my square is already pushed back from the gasket itself. Okay. So my fix was, why not take the tip off? So here is my improved speed square. All right, let's uh, check this out. So now I've cut it just underneath the gasket to where now I can check the rotation of the unit itself. Awesome, so there's no struggle with uh, having the gasket in the way there. You Not don't have to all. peel the gasket off. Exactly, and what would happen is if we started to peel the gasket off, we have a two inch curvature on our gasket with our caulking which is underneath the gasket. So if you pull the gasket off, you would get caulking everywhere on the frame. So it, this alleviates the cleaning and it checks the rotation nicely, as you can see again. All right, nice job, Dave. Thanks again. We also have another improvement that we uh, worked on. Uh, they're joint three quarter inch uh, from top light to bottom light. Uh, as you can see, they're using their tape measures to check that. Okay, once, once they check that, if it's not correct, they usually have to beat the top, top portion of the frame to get the opening correct, or the bottom, vice versa. If whether or not uh, it's, it's open more or closed, the gap. So what we've done, I'll show you here, is created a little, a little template that actually lets us check our three quarter inch without having to pull our tape measure back. So as you can see, they've used and installed these little, little templates here. And what they do is just stick them in and actually adjust the where they need it. So now, basically you set the block in, like so, pull the glass down to where it needs to be, and it bottoms out on your on your template instead of uh, past or maybe even above. Not only does that work for them, it works for me as a double checker as well. But I know that if I can get that in there, both sides of the glass are touching my template, that I know that it is three quarters every time, all the time. Perfect. You don't have to worry about it chipping the glass because it's a, a solid plastic. Exactly. At one point, I do believe they were trying to use an aluminum uh, uh, template, which obviously you know aluminum and glass do not mix. The chip damages the glass. So we went with the neoprene block instead. Awesome. Nice job, guys. Thank you. Hey! Okay. Good morning. My name is David Elliott. I work 